I'm Nare with your news from around the world. Our first stop is Hong Kong, where residents celebrated Buddha's birthday this year on May 14th. Siddhartha Gautama Buddha is the founder of Buddhism, a religion that practices meditation and detachment from emotions to achieve peace. The celebration is known as the Buddha Bathing Festival because according to myth, there were nine dragons that bathed baby Buddha when he was born, not in fire, but water. Citizens gather at Buddhist temples to give statues of Buddha a nice bath, which is meant to symbolize giving their souls a nice bit of spring cleaning. The biggest statue, known as Big Buddha, is at the Po Lin Monastery on Lantu Island, where major partying takes place. People also nibble on green cookies before and after B Buddha's big day to represent getting through life's troubles and enjoying the finer things. Next, we're soaring to Cuba and the Caribbean Sea where citizens celebrate Independence Day on May 20th. It honors Cuba's official independence from the USA in 1902. See, way back in 1492, Christopher Columbus landed on the island of Cuba, which became a territory of Spain at the time. Eventually, a big Spanish-American war took place, ending in 1898 as Cuba was tossed back and forth like a hot potato. Then, Cuba and USA relations got tricky after communist dictator Fidel Castro took over in 1959. But thanks to President Barack Obama's recent historic efforts, our relationship with the island nation is warming up. Good morning.